Al, that's Riash. That's a hospital, Al. So what? So what? So we gotta go see a doctor, Al, before our peckers run off and crawl away, that's what. Look, I'm dripping like a good humor in July, you know what I mean? What are you talking about? I feel fine. You feel fine? Hey, if I got the clap from one of them, you got it at least three times as bad, right? Now listen, Archer went that way, we go this way. Keep your mouth shut, come on. Pike, look at that, that's the Dragons and the soccer champs of i -Corps. They some flashy devils, ain't they? How'd you like to beat the shit out of them? You think what that would do for morale? All right, people, set it down in here. Take five. Okay, Jireens. Listen up here. It is your job to make sure that when a coffin contains a body bag, Mark remains non-viewable, that no one, especially the next of kin, will open that body bag under any circumstances. Okay, load them up. But make sure that the coffins are loaded with the head down. Otherwise, embalming fluid will collect in the feet and the body will begin to decompose. Not sure I'm ready for this. January 14th, 1968. We've been assigned to the combat base at Con Diem, up near the DMZ. We're what they call a replacement company. All the guys are trying not to think about what happened to the company we're replacing. I'm not worried about that. I just hope we get there in one piece. This is supposed to be a pacified area, but after what happened on the last convoy, the guys are all pretty jumpy. They see Viet Cong behind every rice pile, and Vinny almost shot a water buffalo. Captain Collins has been so busy looking out for another ambush, he's gotten us lost three times already. Bisbee, get on the horn and find out what the hell he's stopping for. Yeah, I think you're right. There! Over there! Welcome to Condiem. Now, your company commander tells me you've already had some seasoning under fire. Here at the 1st Battalion, we take a lot of pride in a high body count. Now, the company you're replacing had the highest kill ratio in the whole damn division, and I'd be mighty proud of any unit that fought and died half as courageously as they did. Now, to back you up, we've got fire support on Hill 609, 614, and right here. And we can hit any damn spot in the valley. Charlie can too. Captain, get your people on the northeast perimeter. I want to see all officers and staff NCOs in the command bunker now. Move it! Let's go! Get the hell 
out of here. There's not a goddamn thing you can do in here right now. Yeah, Lieutenant, but you don't know they're blowing away our own men. And the colonel knows what he is doing, goddammit. Now, they're walking the artillery back to the tree line so they can zap the snipers and free that patrol. Yeah, well, he's walking it right over our men. And you know that, man. And you could see that if you weren't hiding down here in this goddamn hole. Man, you give us all that jive about playing Charlie's games by Charlie's rules. And you're fucking down here standing in place from the goddamn bench like Charlie's standing still waiting for the ball to be snapped. Back in the well, man. Go ahead and kill me, man. Hear it. You goddamn mouth shut. Please wash me just for a goddamn minute. Captain. Captain, call off the artillery. Give me a few men. I'll go out and blow those gooks out of that tree line. Lieutenant, the colonel has decided he would rather commit firepower than risk man. Captain, will you God. shut up? And will you get your black ass back on that line before I court martial you both? Jesus Christ. These assholes are not going to help us. Now go ahead now. Go ahead. I need this man. I owe you a favor. Later. You need to sit, man. I'll give it back to you later. Come on, come on. Come on, Pike. Here, Fazio. Busy. Get your ass over here and follow me on the right. double. Come on, Joe. Over the hell it's going on. Keep low. Okay. Everybody stay down. And stay quiet. And don't you fire until I give you the signal. Mike, don't fuck this one up. Now! No, I fucked with that! Yeah, I did it, and I hope I got your mama!